Chapter 1 Old Father's Letter You are listening at FameTV.info The world in front of me is like a dream, and the silhouette of a human being covered under a white veil seems to be talking about something, but the whispering voice is too weak to distinguish. Just as I was about to listen closer, a huge suction force dragged everything into the white veil, and the human silhouette hidden in it was not a creature at all, but a piece of universe, a piece of void, and a piece of unknown. Now I can hear clearly, now I can hear the whispers under the white gauze, it is an extremely strange and inexplicable language. It seems to be understood, but it can backslash t be understood. Countless bizarre knowledge is instilled in the brain, and the scalp is broken, making people almost crazy. The young man gasped and woke up from his sleep. He stood up abruptly as if he hit something with his elbow. He turned his head and saw a lantern overturned on the ground. There was half a black candle in it, and a blue flame flickered on it. He saw that the flame was about to burn to the crumpled letter beside him, so he hurriedly straightened the lantern, why should the lamp be turned on in broad daylight now? The young man was puzzled and suddenly blew on the blue flame. The strange thing was that the flame that seemed to be extinguished could not be extinguished no matter what, the intricate carvings on the lamp base became more and more palpitating, and the already confused thoughts became more chaotic under the influence of the blue flame. The young man didn't backslash t want to be in the same room with this lantern, so he hurried out of the wet tent. Recently, young people often have the dream just now. In that dream, it seems that some unknown person wants to communicate with him, but his spirit cannot bear the message from the other party. Every time I receive an intermittent sentence, I wake up with severe mental pain, nausea, discomfort, and my soul seems to be pulled away. However, the information received this time was different from before, as if it was urging him to do something. But the meaning that could be understood in the dream became blurred after waking up. Lord Dudge, you backslash reawake. A man who looked like a guard outside the tent saw the young man coming out, and hurried forward to offer his condolences. At this time, the memory of the young man was still a little confused. He remembered that his name was Du Wei, but the guard standing in front of him called him Dudge. After taking a closer look at this person, he still recognizes him. It is his father backslash s personal guard named Howard, but why is he protecting him now, and why is he here? Wait, it seems that my name is not Du Wei but Doug Victor. Dewey backslash s thoughts were a little confused. He looked around and observed the surrounding situation. At this moment, they were in the valley. Apart from the guards who had just come up to talk to them, there were more than a dozen people patrolling around. These people were all father backslash s personal guards. Dewey vaguely recalled some things. In the town surrounded by the flames of despair, his father handed over the inheritance in his mouth to him, and then returned to the battlefield with his subordinates, and went to the outer city where the monsters raged alone. People who are evacuating by time, the memory was interrupted at this point, and the back of the neck would ache when thinking about it again. Dewey rubbed the swollen back of the neck and looked at the guard beside him, Howard, why are we here? What happened to my father? Howard glanced at Dewey backslash s red and swollen nape, and swallowed. At that time, the situation was urgent, and Dewey backslash s father asked him to take Dewey into the forest of shadows and hide in this hidden valley, but Dewey tried his best to resist and wanted to go out of the city with his father to meet the monsters. Howard had no choice but to knock Dewey out with a knife, and then carried him over. Judging from the current situation, the young master must have lost his memory. Howard, who had a strong desire to survive, knew that he would tell the young master some white lies at this time, the situation was urgent, and the master asked us to take you to evacuate here first. There was a fire in the city and thick smoke was billowing. You maybe you were choked out, we saw you unconscious, so we came here behind your back. Dewey looked at Howard suspiciously, not sure whether his words were true or not. If he was really choked out, it would be carbon monoxide poisoning, wait, what is carbon monoxide, why do I know this? Dewey tried again to clear his mind and recall the past, the parents and the memory are both strange and familiar. The strange is Dewey, and the familiar is Du Gu. What is wrong with me? Why do I feel that I have two identities, split personality? 
What is split personality? Duwe backslash S scalp was numb, and the more he thought about it, the more dizzy he became, Howard saw the young master backslash S eager eyes, scratching his ears and cheeks anxiously, as if he was trying to recall something, if it reminded him of how he passed out, Howard hurried forward to interrupt. Master, have you read the letter that the master left for you? Before leaving, the master specifically asked Howard to remind the young master to read all the letters. Do way backslash S thoughts were perfectly interrupted, and he looked at Howard with a blank face. Howard pursued the victory and continued. It is the letter that the master gave you before leaving. The content on it is very important, you must read it. Duway scratched his head, and suddenly remembered that there was indeed a crumpled letter in the tent, which was almost lit by a lantern just now, when he returned to the tent, he seemed to have kicked something away, and looked around. Apart from the lantern and letters, it was just a pile of sundries that he carried with him, after confirming that he did not kick the lantern down again this time, Duway picked up the letter and checked. My dearest son, the ancient true did not abandon us. Your birth is the perfect proof. You must have been troubled by why you were born knowing this. This is the talent bestowed on you by the true God, allowing you to retain the memory of your previous life and come to this world guide mankind to prosperity and defeat monsters, that lantern is a sacred object given to our family by the true God. Light the candle on it, and the fire of hope will lead us to the light and give you invincible authority in the world. Father backslash s handwriting was very large, and just two or three sentences filled a page, arranged crookedly on the straw paper born to know it. What the hell, this letter could not have been given to the wrong son. It was handed over to him by mistake. In fact, his father wanted to give it to other sons. Duway thought so, looking at the used matches on the ground, he must have lit the lantern when he saw this before, but he fell into a coma for some reason, flipped to the second page. But remember, the moment the flame is ignited, it will generate a lot of power, which will have a strong impact on the spirit of the igniter, so please make preparations first. Once the flame is ignited, it cannot be extinguished, otherwise the true will send divine punishment to punish those ignorant torch guardians. Only the wildest or most intense emotional awareness can feed the flame to keep it burning. After reading this, Du Wei wanted to scold someone. What happened to his father? If his vital capacity is not enough, it backslash s fine to speak out of breath, but how can he still be out of breath when he writes this letter? How? When writing, I was afraid that my hands would shake and I had to hold my breath, because I broke the chapter at such a critical place. Also, why did I light the candle in such a hurry that I didn't backslash t even bother to turn over one more page? Now the candle was about to burn to the base of the tail, and the time until he received God backslash s punishment had entered the countdown. It says, only the craziest or strongest emotional awareness can be used as nourishment, so is it crazy or the strongest emotional awareness that I am going to be driven crazy now. Du Wei vaguely recalled some things. He originally wanted to share weal and woe with his father, but Howard insisted on dragging himself away, the most irritating thing is that this guy neglects to exercise on weekdays, and he still hasn't backslash, T knocked himself out with a knife in one hand, so he cut him several times, and he was dizzy and dizzy. The back of the neck is unbearably swollen, even a dog couldn't backslash, T do it, but Howard not only did it, but also concealed the truth and lied to himself, that backslash, that's why I wanted to quickly gain the power of being invincible in the world so I lit the black candle without looking down, but the problem is that now the authority has not been seen, and he is still insane intermittently. For a while, he feels that his name is Du Gu, and for a while he thinks that he is Du Wei. Du Wei knew in his heart that now was not the time to argue with Howard, and the top priority was to figure out how to use the lantern, flip to the third page. By the way, the large amount of power released by the candle will eventually condense into an entity, which is the family member closest to the true God. You need to obtain its approval to control the authority that is invincible in the world. If you don backslash t get its approval, it may cause backlash against you, so please light the candle after you are fully prepared and ensure that you have the ability to subdue that family member even if you are not recognized. Love your father the most, Sana Victor Stay. Du Wei slowly raised his head, 
he felt a chill down his back, and from the corner of his eye, he caught a glimpse of a pair of faint blue vertical pupils approaching him quietly. With the help of this dim candlelight, he couldn't backslash t see clearly there is something hidden under the vertical pupils, only a dark shadow the biting cold air hit his lungs like ice cones, and Du Wei had to hold his breath to guard against the coming surprise attack. Just before the opponent was ready to attack, Du Wei made a move first, and he turned his head suddenly to look. The dagger in his hand was not out of its sheath that he saw a mouth rushing towards him, and sharp claws grabbed his shoulders one by one. Damn. Du Wei cursed shortly and forcefully. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.